Alright, so this is the Gaming Greats Scout Trooper from Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. So this is still in the old box to keep with the Gaming Greats um, uniform, but looks the color works pretty well with it. It's pretty dope. Uh, he looks awesome. It's essentially the same mold as the last scout trooper that we had on the, the biker scout with the speeder bike. Of course he's got some added equipment here and stuff, but he looks awesome and I love biker scouts. So I had to get this one. For his first accessory he comes with the pistol. It's a very small pistol but the same one as the last biker scout came with. His other accessory comes with an electro staff baton thing that actually extends out here. Um, and I thought this was supposed to come off but it doesn't look like it does and I don't want to break it. And then he also has the added um, straps and container here on the back and that also attaches to his arm as well in comparison with the original biker scout here it's a little bit differences in paint as well um, there's more dirt in with the original and also his boots are very dirty on the original so this one this one's very clean um, which I like I like the the variety between them I like to have oh some that are clean some that are dirty damaged whatever uh, another difference I also noticed is these um, pouches here he does not have okay now for articulation again this is mostly the same articulation from the original which is an older figure but the articulation on this one is actually pretty good because he had to ride on the bike um, so we'll start with the head here goes all the way around um, not a whole lot of tilt but goes forward super far and goes back really well too um, and then okay so on the shoulders we'll come to our first actual difference in articulation now with the original the shoulder pad is pretty hard pretty solid it still is up high enough to where you can get your get the arm up but with that it probably wouldn't come over this strap here so what they did is they have that newer soft softer plastic for the shoulder pads that they've been doing so you can still get that up about the same as you could on the original but because of the strap it gets up over it yeah shoulder goes all the way around there's a swivel there double jointed elbow that is almost too good it goes all the way back And then uh, swivel and rocker on the hand. The hand rockers are like to the side, different than most other people, most other figures. But that's because he, you know, was built to ride on the bike. Not a whole lot of abdomen movement here because there's a lot blocking it. Um, as for the legs, goes up that high. Swivel at the thigh. Double jointed knee goes all the way back, and then there's also a swivel at the shin, and then swivel and rocker on the foot. So he can, again, he's built to, to be able to sit on a bike, so he's got really good articulation despite being a very old mold. He also has two peg holes on the bottom of his feet, this is where most figures only have one. One other complaint I have is that the staff, just like with the Electro Staff Purge Trooper, is that the staff just seems too thick. Like his hands kind of have to spread a bit to fit in there. So 
So yeah, it's a pretty great figure. I love having it. I love having more than one uh, biker scout. And I'll actually be getting another one, uh, assuming Amazon can get their exclusive um, biker scout to me when that comes out. So yeah, super happy with this one. It's a great mold, even though it's old. Great articulation. Not too many complaints about it. But yeah, that's all I got for this one. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Auf Wiedersehen.